as well. All right, so this is the first part of the Spider-Man suit build series. I've had several designs. I've been working on this idea for months. So I'm going to go over the basic, basic rough first part of the suit. We're going to slowly try to put this thing together over time, but this video should be showing the first model of a basic suit that will let me climb walls and climb other objects. So let's take a look at how we're going to go about this. So what we have here is a controller backpack. Now this backpack is only about 10 inches wide. It has a large lithium battery in it, something like this, that is rated at around 14 volts. That battery runs this winch that's originally meant for a car. It's capable of 3,000 pounds, obviously. Now, I've tested this system before, but basically what you do is using a remote, which I currently have a wired one on, you can control the winch. This one is a little bit slow, but it's extremely strong. So I know that I can, in the future, buy one that's a little faster and a bit less strong and just make a smaller, more condensed version that's not as heavy. However, the basic idea is to use that winch along with a grappling hook. Now, Spider-Man, of course, has webs that he can shoot, but so far in the real world, we barely have anything close to the idea of a real web shooter. So what I'm using instead is literally grappling hooks and rope. And by throwing or firing these grappling hooks and winching up, it's essentially a similar thing to being able to shoot a web and pull up that web or swing from the web like you would, or swing from the rope like you would a piece of web. So it's a similar concept and it allows me to do the same thing essentially. So it's gonna be a big bulky suit but we're going to test it out and do a few other things tomorrow as I just finished wiring this thing up tonight. So that's the intro, that's the basic system, try to stick around. Alright, so it's the next day and I'm getting ready to go out and do a test, I'm all suited up. This is G6 Ballistic Motorcycle Armor, which I'll need if I'm going to either hit or swing into anything or fall and break my back because... I'm not actually Spider-Man, and if Spider-Man were to exist, you need a lot of armor and a lot of protection, because that dude could swing into buildings at the speed of 40 miles per hour and self-heal, but I cannot. So I'm wearing full armor, um, got knee pads, boots, climbing harness, and full motorcycle armor. So it's definitely going to be interesting, I even brought a Spider-Man mask. Miles Morales style. Miles Morales. We're gonna use that just for pictures and stuff. And in the back seat, lithium backpack and our winch and the grappling hook. So I'll use those carabiners to basically tie it to myself. We'll throw the grappling hook up somewhere and try to winch up. Now before I did this with steel cable, this time I'm using 550 paracord. And I know that the paracord has held my weight in the past, but it is still going to be sketchy because this time I actually have it in the winch, and instead of steel cable that held 3,000 pounds, I'm using 550 pound paracord. So we're going to try it out. We're going to be safe, but it's definitely uh, risky. This is test two of the grappling hook. What's going through your mind right now, Logan? I'm going to die. Did you say I'm going to die? Yeah. Look at that perfect execution. Gonna take out some slack. Just to be clear, if you break the net, I would say. Uh. In all honesty, the ropes are going to break. The legend himself. He's climbing a wall. What? What? Okay. 
cannot believe this broke his whole I know, it's paracord, right? <laughs> We're switching up the angles because Slay's a clip in the photography. Probably a fast way to go down too. Just let all the line out and fall. It doesn't work when there's tension on it. Yeah, we'll just go down. Safe way. Look at this kid in the back. He's like, what is going on? Mommy, I need to use the bathroom. I'm scared. Okay, now I'm gonna back. Wow. That's crazy. Oh, no, this piece more. Okay, we're back. So it could definitely be way faster, but the concept works at least. It does. Are you playing music? Oh. Woo! Applause. Should the video keep going? Ooh. <laughs> uh, he's cut. Oh, no. He's, oh! Uh, no! Uh, uh, no! <laughs> Is it? Ain't I'm hanging on the island, please. Oh! Woo. Hello? Hello? <laughs> uh, and we're back. What's going on, kid? I'm not sure if he knows I'm filming him. Okay. Are you still filming? I'm still filming. Well, currently have a situation. Tangled around the edge of this net. Okay, well, sure this is it. it'd be a shame if we had a grappling hook to get up there, but... I think I'm gonna have to climb up there myself to get said grappling hook. Okay. Yeah. Meanwhile... I don't know how this video... What am I doing? <gasps> what? Is there playing volleyball? Did you record a little audience we got there? I did. Kids. I recorded a lot of audience. <laughs> and the rope. Do you have a name for it yet? This thing? Yeah. It's like a Spider-Man winch, isn't it? I feel like Fred's a good name. Fred? Okay. Jack. We could call it Fred. Fred it is. Fred is okay. Wow. I don't place. Oh. I have number one. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. You got this. Oh my goodness. I'm just so happy I'm recording. Oh. Spider-Man. Whoa. That's actually smooth looking. Okay. Okay. The man. The myth. Dab for me. The legend! Okay, we're done. The results were in test number one. Well, number two really did work. So this simple concept of using an electric motor as a winch and a grappling hook does work. I can go up things. The problem is it needs to be a lot faster. Now this winch was really cheap. Sorry, I'm out of breath. It was really cheap. If I built this thing from scratch with custom motors and pulleys, it would work really well, I think. So if you like this so far, drop me a like or comment on a way you think I could improve or imitate Spider-Man's tech a little better. I know I could mount a grappling hook to my wrist. And I can do that by firing it with carbon dioxide or compressed air. And I can make the grappling hook smaller so that I can do that for my wrist. But I have the basic concept down of how to climb things. In fact, I could have climbed something much higher than that. That was mainly just a test to make sure that the paracord would hold. And I'm very grateful for my friend filming me. I think he did a great job narrating. So, so again... Uh, Drop a like or something, let me know if you <laughs> what you thought of his narrating job. This is gonna have to be a multi-stage project. It's gonna have to be an armored suit. Potentially, I'm gonna have a lot more straps. Possibly even a power suit model that will help me uh, endure the load of holding onto the rope and go up much, much higher things. So, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you wanna see more projects like this and see this build go further. And I'll see you guys next time.